So how are you supposed to charge your Google Pixel when you leave the charger at home? Let's try a secondary option. Maybe it's tertiary. Let's try another way to charge the Google Pixel and see how slow it charges when it doesn't have 30 watts. So this is the Pixel 6 Pro by Google. And the charger today is gonna be a Samsung Adaptive Fast Charger. This produces max output of nine times 1.6, yeah, 15 watts. I'll double check the math and throw it up there. Anyway, yeah, nine volts at 1.67 amps. And then this is a cool cable. I got it off Amazon. It's Mako McDodo and it measures, well, I'll just show you. So you plug that into a wall, and then as soon as you plug this in, watch this. Zero watts, 2.5 watts. The phone is at 4%. Time of life, 11.55. Now it's drawing 8.6 watts, and that's about it. Interesting. I don't know why it's not drawing at least 15 watts. I wonder if it's because it's off. Well, we'll leave it off for a little bit. I like the animation, by the way. Good job, Google. And see how fast or how slow it charges with this non-Google charger. See you soon. And after that, I got pretty much tied with work and the phone took another hour to fully charge. It took just forever. It is not a fast char charging phone. I don't, recommend, I don't recommend the Google Pixel 6 Pro. And it was constantly overheating. The battery life is okay, but it does not know how to fast charge if you compare it to the OnePlus phone or Samsung phones. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.